Is your iPhone randomly delete some of the contacts from your iPhone? And when you just try to search some of the contacts from your iPhone, you'll see that mysteriously those contacts vanished into the thin air? Well, look no further. Today, I'm going to give you guys an ultimate guide to solve the random deleting contacts problems on iPhone. So, let's get started. But first thing first, you gotta sync your iCloud contacts on your iPhone all over again. For that, open up your settings on your iPhone, tap Apple ID from here, then you scroll down and tap on iCloud from here, click see all from here, and after that, you gotta scroll down a bit and find out the contact option. So if you see these features already enabled, just go ahead and toggle it up and keep it to your iPhone. Just hold for some time and then just go ahead and turn it back on again. After that, just offload your contact applications. Now, next, you got to go back to your settings all over again on your iPhone. Then scroll down, tap General, and then tap iPhone Storage. Scroll down a little and find out your contact application. You can simply tap Show All to have all the application here. Find out a contact application from here. Tap Offload Application. Tap Offload App again, and then tap Reinstall. After that, it's going to remove some of the bugs or glitches that might be the cause for, you know, vanishing our random contacts on iPhone. Now, after that, just go ahead and see whether your problem is solved or not. So let's say you have done that, but still you have the same problems. The next thing that you have to do, you got to just update your phone. Now, just go ahead and open up your settings on your iPhone, scroll down, tap general, and tap software update. Sometimes updating your iPhone to the latest software version can actually solve the minor bugs or glitches now update your software if you got it and after that your problem is going to be solved let's say if there's no software update available on your iphone then all you guys can do you can simply get back here scroll down here and you can simply tap transfer or reset iphone now once you just do it and then you have to select reset and then choose reset all settings now if you just do this i can tell you guys if the minor box or glitches or if the faulty setting is causing this problem, it is going to solve your problem. Now, if you guys have any more questions to ask, please let me know in the comment section. See you guys around.